We are united as one borough, one borough. All of us are outraged when a Jewish person is struck. We're outraged when a Baptist church is burnt. We're outraged when someone writes graffiti on a mosque. We're outraged anytime someone persecutes an individual because of their religious beliefs. We want to be clear with that. If to the young people who had the goal, the audacity to attack another person. Society does not accept this. This society is clearly making a statement that attacks on another person will not be tolerated. In, in, the, in the rubble in my office, um, my office filled with plots and citations from all walks of life over, from over 20 years. But I look and there's some pictures and the frame of the picture, it burned, but the picture was there, and it's a picture with me and a rabbi. And I said, wow, the Jews and the Gentiles, we are still standing. <laughs> Once we allow attacks like this to happen, we can start to see a lot of the war that we see all over the world. This is a very special place, it's a very sacred place. And this is a place where people come for freedom. This is a place where people come to raise their families. And no one, regardless of their race or religion, should have to live with fear because of their beliefs or what it is that they believe to be true to their values. Be careful, watch the, watch the big boy. Watch the boy. The and everybody. Be careful. Watch the big boy. Can't walk backwards. You need someone to lead you. I'll, I'll trust you. Okay. Okay. Give me face time. I guess I feel bad. That's okay, sorry. Barry. I love I'm sorry. you. I'm sorry. Sometimes. Oh, my God. How, how about today? Be careful. Be careful. I'll make it up. I'll take you out to lunch. Okay. Deal. You promised that a long time ago. I know, exactly. <laughs> you were there, right? Yes. I have a witness. Sure. Watch the car, everybody. Watch the car. Everyone shift to the right. <laughs> To our left. Really, the public advocate. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Okay, camera guys, you can turn around for a minute. <laughs> I'm waiting for Cadence next. <laughs> Watch the tree, big guy. Let's think of it. Video. to Yosef and to demand justice for what happened and to make sure with God's help another Jewish person will never be gunned down because of his faith on his way to synagogue. Okay, we're here standing here united with everyone of many, many races to speak out to say that we will not tolerate any kind of anti-Semitism any kind of bigotry, any kind of racism from anywhere. We will fight you at every turn, and we will not turn and run. Let me, uh, let me just say something else that I know is very important to talk about. Uh, I know there's concern with regard to uh, the people down in Miami doing the everything to, be, to apprehend those responsible. Uh, I made a commitment to members of the family been in touch with people down there. We need to apply pressure in every way. There are no excuses. Every resource in the world has to be put into this. And it's unfortunate that some people, some people, while the blood was still in the street, were already saying it's not anti-Semitism, it's not racism, it's not anything like that. How did they know? They admit they don't know anything. They have no information. So how did they know to say that it wasn't related to hate? So we are determined to do whatever we can, and with God's help at the very least, to apprehend two people who went out. I mean, it's hard to comprehend what human being, by the way, it can't be a human being, who would go out, a man on his way to synagogue, clearly identifiable as a Jew. They would shoot him. They would murder him in cold blood. So we are determined to do everything possible. I know the borough president feels very strongly about this. Can I just say a few words? Yeah, for sure. To me, this shot was heard all around the world. And I hope and pray that the shot will bring the world to peace. 
A person should be able to walk down the street, be it in Florida, New York, Israel, or the Ukraine, and should not be afraid that he'll be murdered in cold blood. We have to educate our children, young and old, that people matter. You matter, I matter, we all matter. And that's what's important. We're horrified what happened, and we want to make sure that justice is